Hey, what's up guys? So, Totally Accurate Battle Simulator has just been released, and I'm actually really excited. I've been looking forward to this game, so I can't wait to play it. And we're going through the campaign mode, so we're going to see how things go. So, if you don't know what the game is, it's basically, you have the enemy people there, which are weird random club people at the moment. Fair enough. And then we place our ones here, and we have a choice out of all these people down here. And there's all these different ones. Okay, that's coming soon. That's coming soon. That's coming soon. There we go. That's the first lot there. Well, that's the first lot. But that's the end lot. But we can't actually use them by the looks of it. They're greyed out. So I guess they unlock as we go through the campaign mode, I'd assume. So we've got all them different ones. So we'll get to them when we get to them. So we're on the first lot. And we can only use the first three of the first lot as well so far. So, I'm not really sure how it works. I mean, they do have a price. So, oh, I see. So, yeah, so that costs 60. We've got 600 to spend. That's 80. That's 120. And we just have to beat them. So, I guess we just get started on it. So, what have we got? We've got six club people to go up against. So, do we try putting some of these down? See if they can win? Let's just go for the strongest ones and see what happens. Oh, they're spear throwers. Okay, in that case, we don't want them that close. We actually want to start them a bit further back so they don't get into the close range battle straight away. So, let's just see how that works. The controls are pretty simple. You just use keyboard and mouse. And if we left click, I think we can actually go, yeah, slow motion. Look at them go. And I think G puts it in super slow motion, but I mean, that's just way too slow. Look at it. It's pretty much just static. So let's press G and get back into normal time. Oh, oh, wow. Okay. And we lost. Right. That didn't work. That did not work, guys. I quite like the fact that all you have to do is place them down, click start, and then they just go at each other. It's a bit like... Um, the epic battle simulator game um just it by the looks of it it looks a lot more fun and a lot more levels in it because that other one was actually pretty boring so it seems quite good compared to that one by the looks of it so that didn't work so what have we got we've got shield people so what if we was to put down some shields let's put one spear thrower down and we'll put down um Let's put another spear thrower and we'll put some shields down so then that hopefully that will hold them off while the spears get them. I hope it isn't going to be as simple as being slow motion for the first attacks. Oh, look at it go. Oh, that guy took one to the gut. Oh, that was pretty nice. I like that. I like how stupid they all look. They're <laughs> just flailing around. So what have we still got? We've got two free shields left, and our throwers, and only two, oh, only one club person. Nice, we won it. Nice, I was hoping we'd win it, rather than having to use the lowest ones, because that wouldn't make sense, but we won. So what do we do? We press tab to continue, so I guess on to the next level then. There we go, next level. Okay, that actually, yeah, it makes sense to use tabs, it is the game is called tab kind of work so what have we got are these just loads of spear throwers now um if they're all spear throwers we don't really want to throw at them we want let's hmm it's quite tough to decide whether uh, do i try throwing spears at them as well let's put down some shields because then that way they can protect against the spears Three each, do you reckon? And then let's put some club people down behind them. Um, we could have one more shield, so let's put him there just to hopefully take some focus away from the others. And let's go again. Oh, okay. That hit him. Oh, there we go. That's when I wanted to do the slow motion, not before that. I like the way the shield people just dive into them. And then the club people, I mean, I don't know what they're actually doing. Oh, that was brutal. Right to the face. Absolutely brutal, that was. 
So, I mean, okay, they're dying, but kind of killing as well. What's going on over here then? Okay, over here it looks like it's gone a bit worse for us because all we've got is two shields. We don't have a club person. So, let's let it go in full time. Although, they're doing quite well. Oh, though he got hit. We should win this, actually. There's only one of them left. Boom! And we won again. Okay, that was actually quite easy, that one. I mean, th these are only the opening levels, so I kind of expect them to be quite easy just to get used to the game. So, on to the next one. What do we have now? I'm guessing these are all going to be different eras, maybe? Because by the looks of it, the weapons sort of improve as we go along. Nope, they're the coming soon ones. Yeah, so I think they're different eras. So at the moment we're in, what, prehistoric? And then, I don't know what the next one will be, but I'm sure we'll find out when we get to it. That'll be in another video, though. So make sure to like this one, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and then whenever I do them new videos, you'll get to see them first. So what do we have? We have... Whatever this guy is, what what is he? Bone mage. Okay. I don't like mages, but... Okay, so no idea what he's going to do to us. And then we've got a stoner. Okay, I'm nicknaming him Pothead. It works. Then we've got some standard club people. And then same on the other side. Okay, so plan for this one. We've got a bit more money this time. So we can actually put down quite a few people. Um, let's try, let's put groups of people down, let's try it that way, so if we put them down, um, put a club person behind each one, so then that way they can take the hit, and then maybe put some spear throws down, let's see how that goes. I'm hoping that'll work quite well. Whoa. Okay. The potheads do quite well. They're actually quite tough. Oh, I see. But they take a long time to actually throw their next one. That makes sense. I have no idea what's actually going on at the moment. I mean, there's only two of them left. Boom. Wow. What a throw that was. Right to the chest. And look at him. Doing a little dab as well as he died. Nice. At least he goes out in style. Awesome. And well done to you, mate. You did it. Even if you are leaning back and looking really weird. Nice. On to the next one. Oh, okay. By the looks of it, the difficulty has just gone, like, right up. Wow. Okay. So what have we got? We've got loads of shields and loads of clubs. But, oh, I see. We've unlocked the next ones now. Nice. So, I didn't actually see what the uh, Bone Mages did in the last one. Did we actually get to see that? I weren't paying attention to them. Um, I quite like the stone throwers, though. So, let's put down... I don't know. We'll put down three of those. Let's put down some shields as well to protect them. Hopefully, they'll clash with them, keep them together in a group, and then hopefully they'll do quite a bit of area damage. Um... Let's put down some spear chuckers. Um, put down some club people. Let's put down some more. Two on each. And um, we've got 120 left, so we'll put down another spear chucker. There we go. Oh, look at them clashing. Oh. Whoa, okay. That's a lot. That's really hard to see what's actually going on. But I think we're losing. By the looks of it. Let's have a look. I mean... I think that guy's about to kill someone. Oh, that guy. That guy. Throw, throw your spear at him. Quick. Oh, no. He missed. Um, yeah. I think we're going to lose. That is a lot of blue and very little red. Oh. That was a hit. Look at them. Just ploughing in. What are they doing? Um. Yeah, he weren't surviving that. Jesus, that is a lot of people. Right, so we lost. Okay. So that didn't work. 
So let's clear that because that definitely didn't work. Let's put in some of the uh, bone mages then. Let's see what they actually do. Should we just... Oh, I didn't want to put that many down. <laughs> let's, uh, let's just throw down six of those and we'll just see what they do. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, well, that went quite well. And we won. That was over really fast. Why didn't I just do that to begin with? They are like definitely OP though. That was way too much damage. How come he's got a really little head compared to that one that's got a massive head? Oh, look how small his head is. He's so tiny. Nice. Right, so we're on to the next level. I have skipped a few of them in this video. But I have already recorded them as we've gone through. So they'll be in the next video and you'll see me playing them for the first time. So you won't miss anything and I won't know what I'm doing still, which will be fun. But I've put this one in, in this video because of the name of the bad guy. And it was Mammoth. So there he is. There is the little Mammoth. I say little. He's not exactly little. He's gigantic. But he's got really cute blinky eyes. So, we've got to work out how we want to fight the Mammoth. Should we just do like a 1v... Oh, we can't. I wanted to do a 1v1 Mammoth battle, but that is way too expensive. We don't have enough for it. Um, should we do it proper caveman style type thing? Like old school, just loads of spears. Let's do it. Let's uh, put groups of them around so we can flank it. Uh, we'll put one club man down just for the fun of it and hopefully we'll win so let's take on the mammoth look at it it's gigantic compared to them let's go and slow oh oh that is a lot of hits already look at all of them boom okay that is brutal that is absolutely brutal Nice, right. Let's go back into full speed and let's see if we can win. And my mouse is playing up in case you're wondering why the camera wasn't rotating. Are we going to win? Uh oh. No. Oh, we did. Oh, look at that one guy surviving. Doing a little Matrix Neo bullet dodge type thing. That is impressive. If only that was actually stabbing in though. That would have been even better. That is amazing. Look at that. Well done, mate. You won. Right, so to end this video, we've come into sandbox mode because that way we could put enemies on both sides. And unlike other YouTubers that always say 1,000 people versus a mammoth when really they only put in about 10 because they really do like clickbaiting, we're going to see how many people we can put in against how many mammoths and see who wins. Now, it's probably going to make the game lag so if it does, then obviously I'll just have to hope for the best. And we'll just keep reducing people down until we get away from the lag. But I say we just go for it. So how many mammoths should we start off with? Let's put in... Let's do 10. Let's do 10 mammoths versus... Oh, we've got all of these unlocked as well. Oh, wow, okay. These are a lot of different ones. We won't actually use them though because it might spoil the other levels. So we'll stick to our first lot. And we'll go for... Let's go for the Spearman. So what have we spent? We've spent 22,400 on Mammoths. So should we spend the same on these guys? I say we do. I say we just... Let's just place them all down. I mean... I'm just randomly putting them anywhere. We're getting close, 22,200. I mean, that's the closest we're going to get to it, but I think the Mammoths are going to win. So let's add the extra one and go 40 over. And let's start and see who wins. Let's go. And, oh, that's not too bad. It is lagging, but not too much. We'll still try and reduce it down, though, if we can, because that is quite a bit of lag. So it seems that our men have actually killed quite a few mammoths already. Yeah. 
the men absolutely annihilated the mammoths. I mean, there is loads of them left. That is crazy. Okay. So, because that was already lagging, what we're going to do is we're not going to add more mammoths. We're going to take people away. Now, I don't actually know how many I put down. So, that was only 187 people versus 10 mammoths, and they they won by miles. So, these people saying that they've put in 1,000 against one mammoth, it's obvious what's going to happen. The mammoth's going to die straight away. And the game's going to lag massively. So, they are clickbaiting, but we're trying not to do that. So, I'm thinking, what if we take out... 87 so then we've only got a hundred let's try that let's try taking out 87 of them um, I don't really know how many 87 is well they're only 120 so 1,000 would be what, what 12,000 obviously how stupid of me. My mind has completely drawn a blank with it. So we want 12,000. Let's, let's keep them close because I don't like these guys at the back. So what we'll do is we'll take those out and then we'll put them closer to make up for it. There we go. So that is 100 people versus 10 mammoths. Let's go. There we go. That's not lagging now. Look at them go. I wonder who's going to win this one then. Oh. Have the mammoths got it? I think we've got a mammoth down on the left hand side. There's one thing I wish they'd put into this game. Is a little counter to tell you how many of each are left. That'd be quite nice. And the mammoths had it. So 10 mammoths against 100 people can win. But if you add 87 more, they can't. That's interesting. So, what we're going to do is we're going to add, what, another 50? Do we do another 50? Hmm. Can't work out how many to do, really. Let's, um, let's, let's do another 50, and we'll see what happens. So, let's put in some more, some more, some more, some more. There we go. So, that's 150 people and 10 mammoths. Let's go. And it's lagging again. We have a little bit more lag. And we have a lot more mammoths down. So just 50 more seems to help the people a lot. Not these ones over here. They're not really... Oh, there we go. I think the men are going to have it. Um, I think we've come to a little standstill because... They can't actually get to each other. I mean, that one is just getting destroyed. Oh, there we go. They're finally hitting it. Yeah, so 50 more men. So 150 men can take on 10 mammoths. Okay, so let's get rid of all of that. Oh, let's just clear that side. So now we're going to do 10 mammoths straight on. With 10 mammoths. I said in, earlier in the video 1v1 mammoth, but let's forget that. Let's do 10v10 mammoth. Let's go. Let's do it. Come on. Oh, look at them go. It's just a bundle of meat. <laughs> that is all it is. Just a bundle of meat. They can't even get to each other. We have got a couple down already. Just be interested to see who wins. Who's, who's still alive? They're still alive over there. You've still got some of these alive. They're still sort of going at each other. Have we only got... Oh no, we've got those two red. And I think we've got two blue. So this is going to be interesting. I think the reds are going to have it. Oh no, blue took it. Wow. Well done, Mr. Blue Mammoth person man animal thing nice so yeah that's been totally accurate battle simulator absolutely awesome game love playing it if you want to see more make sure to drop a like subscribe hit the notification bell 
and we'll continue through the campaign mode. Peace out. <laughs>